50 city leaders have decided bidding on the 2024 Olympics is a risk worth taking. The city council voted unanimously today to back the bid that could bring the Olympics back to the Southland for the third time. CBS 2's Randy Page was at today's star studded announcement. Councilmember Bluenfield. Going for the gold. Votes aye. The vote. Councilmember Englander. Aye. Absolutely, yes. Bring the games to Los Angeles. Was unanimous. A, a very enthusiastic eye. As the Los Angeles City Council gave Mayor Eric Garcetti the green light to submit Los Angeles as the American bid city for the 2024 Olympic Games. It's a 15 way tie for an Olympic gold medal. I vote aye. Two hours later, United States Olympic Committee Chairman Scott Blackman made it official. It's my distinct honor today to formally name the city of Los Angeles as the U.S. bid to host the 2024 Olympic and Paralympic Games. And here we are in a city that represents to all of us human possibility, ingenuity, creativity, and diversity. Mayor Eric Garcetti said he was 13 years old when he watched Carl Lewis set a new world record in the 1984 L.A. Games. I saw and felt the closing ceremony, felt that energy, saw the transformative power of the games, not just to change my life, but to change the life of my city forever. Many LA Olympians were on hand for the event, including four-time gold medalist Greg Luganis, who earned two gold medals in the 1984 Olympics in Los Angeles. LA was so friendly. I mean, there were foreigners who were lost, and then the locals were like, okay, follow me, I'll take you to your event, you know? And it was just such a magical time to be in LA. And Oscar De La Hoya, a Garfield High School graduate who received a gold medal for boxing in the 1992 Summer Games in Barcelona. It would be remarkable, it would be incredible for our city if we can uh, bring back the games uh, and, and relive those moments, those uh, moments that uh, I will cherish for the rest of my life. This morning, City Council President Herb Wesson used a wedding analogy, saying today was just the engagement. Before we can have a wedding, a prenuptial agreement will have to be hammered out, as the city now tries to balance financial risk on one hand with a strong enough bid to get the games on the other. Or to put it another way, let the negotiations begin. In Santa Monica, Randy Page, CBS2 News.